Hey guys, welcome back to another fantastic episode of Ready to Die Fighting. I'm Chris, and today I want to tell you why you should stock up on some board games. It doesn't have to be sorry, this is just one that we like. Um, got some headbands, Trouble is a fun one. Guess who? Not as much. I don't, I don't really like that one as much. Connect Four, we've got a big thing of poker, which neither one of us know how to play, but just in case some adults come around who know how and want to play, we have it. Um, so why? Why are board games a prepper item? Well, if you are stuck in your house for potentially weeks, and you're because you're sick or maybe there's some sort of other situation where you're sheltering in place that can get real boring real quick especially for the kids and bored kids are annoying in case you didn't know that bored kids are annoying additionally if they're bored and have nothing to do then that's a lot scarier just sitting there waiting for something bad to happen so keep them entertained Keep the morale up, keep a distraction, and a great way to do that is with board games. Um, and what I like about this, in addition, is like board games are generally good for people to learn team building and taking turns, and sometimes the memory and coordination and strategy, depending on what kind of game it is. So all that stuff is good stuff anyway. But get them now, start playing them now, so that you know which games you like, which games are fun or age appropriate you know you have access to the internet so you can look up the rules because sometimes it's not always clear how you play these things uh, get all that stuff out of the way now I limit how much Nate can play video games and watch TV and when he's not allowed to do those things we a lot of times play board games whether there's a power outage or not um, if you watched our video about our uh, fake blackout we spent a good amount of time playing board games with the stuffed animals while we were waiting for dinner to cook and we had a great time like it was legitimately fun we we do that on a regular basis so i think it's a good investment every time i go to uh the store uh, i go to meyer i always walk through the game section and when if there's on sale I, I buy one that's on sale and so we've got some more over here um these are just the ones that i'm we've got we've got quite a few and he wants more even so I think that's a great way to um, approach sheltering in place is don't forget about the entertainment of course you want food you want water <coughs> you're gonna need some sort of protection uh, medical supplies you need all that stuff for sure that should be the high priority um, but then after that think about what it's gonna be like when you are sheltering in place like you're stuck in this house and you can't leave um, something you want to keep in mind is that as human beings we are social we are community driven creatures uh, we are also used to having jobs <laughs> so something else you want to keep in mind in addition to entertainment but make sure everybody has a job even if it's an insignificant job give the kids a job you know their their jobs right now are probably to go to school and keep their room clean and uh, you know that may be it make sure they have something to do so workbooks um, I have a lot of workbooks that Nate uses on weekends and during the summer or if he's just being annoying I'm like okay go do some math <laughs> make sure they have that so they can keep their brain stimulated so they're distracted they're focused on something aside from how scary the situation is and also so that they can continue um, their development and you know they don't go back to school in a month or two months or whatever it is and you know they're dumb and forgot everything so make sure you have some workbooks for them some games for them some books for yourself some games for yourself whatever else you know hobbies you have have a hobby have a hobby it's a great stress relief it's um, <clears throat> good for your development and everything this YouTube channel is one of my hobbies I'd like to turn it into a career that would be wonderful like if this was my job and I could just do this every day you know how you can make that dream come true for me you could hit that subscribe button and uh, that helps the channel grow that helps me be motivated to keep doing this it lets me know that you guys like and appreciate these videos like share subscribe and I will keep them coming with this type of content and I've got a lot of other fun stuff happening very soon if you want to stay in the loop 
you gotta keep watching. All right, I think that's all I have to say in this video. So you guys, have a good day. Good luck out there. Stay safe, stay warm or cool, whatever, whatever temperature you wanna be. Stay there, stay there.